Welcome friends, my name is Brandon, also known as the Lethargic Sloth, and it's time to check out Georgia at the Eurovision Song Contest. This year we have Nutza with the song Firefighter. I forgot her last name in just that moment. It's me, so big shock. <laughs> Let's check out what Georgia brings for us this year with Firefighter. It's been a long time since Georgia's qualified. I would like to see it happen. I thought it was going to happen last year. This is good. I like the beginning. <laughs> She can do all this and sing. This is a solid song. <laughs> Put out the fire dance. <laughs> she can do all the dancing and choreography and still sing and still get the vocals. Georgia qualify? Vocals. So many of these dance songs don't have this kind of vocals. This is what make what you can do to make me like a dance song. Have a vocalist that can sing. This is how you win people like me to vote for a song like this. This is how it's done. I'm really excited to see this. Look at the mu music too. Listen to the music. It's got everything. I'm going to be so disappointed if this doesn't go by. Yeah. Georgia. You nailed it. I, okay, so I actually, I knew, I, I think if I remember correctly, I don't know if it was last year or earlier, uh, she was in, in American Idol. I don't watch the show, so I had no idea. I've never heard of Nutza before. This is a great song. This is a great song. If this doesn't qualify, there is something going on here. Um, yeah, uh, it's got a little bit of everything. Musically, it's beautiful composition. I love the backup violins, the beat. Normally these are things that are not the violins, but the, like the beat and everything, and even the drop. Normally that's something off-putting to me. Uh, dance break. Oh, do we really need another dance break? It happens so much. Uh, this has smooth transitions. It's interesting. Three minutes of just fun. And yeah, it's, it's different in that it's a genre I don't normally gravitate towards, but I really like this. I, it might make my top 10. That would be a shock. I'm not a dance music person. I'm really not. Uh, this is going to be fun to see live, and I imagine imagery-wise, it's going to be very nice to see. Um, yeah, I think this is going to qualify. Uh, Georgia might be back in the finals, and I'm so ready for it. Hey, if Ireland can do it, make the finals in the 2020s, 
Georgia certainly can as well. So we shall see, see if uh, Nutza takes the fire and burns down the house. Uh, and I won't make the same joke about burning the roof off the house. I already did that. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, what do you think of the song for Georgia? Do you think it's a qualifier? Do you think it's not going to qualify? Um, and where do you rank this in your personal top list? I like it a lot. I really do. Uh, we shall see where it ends up in my list. She might make my top ten. We shall see. That is to be determined. Uh, Georgia, yeah, qualifier. And in the finals, yeah, could have a very solid position and end up, I don't know, 15th? That I, I don't know that it can win just because there are songs that are favorite, heavy favorites, but uh, certainly could be middle of the pack if it makes it to the finals, in my opinion. Um, certainly is a... It could surprise people and do a lot better than expected. It might have a little bit of balance between jury and, you know, it does sound like a radio-friendly song that you could just throw on and, and play. So oh, we just, we'll see how Georgia does. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Is Georgia going to qualify? Do you like the song? Let me know. For now, Lethargic Sloth, out.